Okay, now let's go to the property inside. And uh, yeah, I, I decided to start from here which is actually the main entrance for the property. You can see that this fence has been put to make a dock uh, area a bit much more smaller and closer to the, to the main house here. But all this, in my opinion, is just, just gone. So you can just take off this, burn, enjoy the fire and the flames, and then you have an open one. And if you, make it, if you want to make a separate garden area, for the docks you always can do it look at this one yeah there's a door here even but in my opinion all this up to here because this is where the land the orchards finish so up to here this all behind this this fence here is the municipality park green park area you can have a look and see it yeah so this is all behind this wall this wall this wall up to the bend there to the bend here should be stay as it is or change with a new one but this one behind this one is just a just a park municipality area all the rest you can take it off plus this one if you want okay let me show the house underneath here while we're here it's a really good condition maybe need some painting and put a lacquer Otherwise, it doesn't look bad at all, like you can see, yeah. Then the windows here downstairs, they're all changed to wooden one with a double glazed. And up there, there also are double glazed. You can see the wooden one, which is not bad. They just need painting because of the sun in South Face property. It's been burned all day. They really need to be painted. They are still in a good condition, so we don't need to change them, just need to, to paint them. You can see the thickness, the double glazed. Yeah. And this area, if you want, you can change this because some of the tile is gone and it's a proper concrete. If it's me, I will retile all this. Look at this beautiful stonework. If you remember, we saw yesterday similar, but the different color of the stone, so different areas, different color. So this one do not came from the river compared with the one we saw yesterday. The roof of this is a really one, proper one. No problem at all. This is where the kitchen and diner area is. We're going to see this now. And there is a small storage here below the lovely balcony. You can see, I think we can uh, do some... Oh my God, it's tied up here. Can I show you from here, from the window? It's not serious. It's not serious. How I can make it this one? This one is a really like a storage of it. I don't know, can I show you or not? You can maybe see it. This is will be by yourself. I just put my hand in. Can you see it? I hope you see it. I can feel the spiders and the net. My favorite touch, my favorite touch. So I hope it wasn't so bad. Anyway, yeah, it's going on in there, just the storage below the, the fence. Let's go and have a look. This is a lovely, lovely sun out. In, ah, while we're here, I hope you can see it. I'll zoom the extension entrance roof. I hope you can see it's, it's really in a good condition. So what mainly, if we need to, to make a, like a brief uh, conclusion, the main house roof is good, just a plaster of the rich tiles and this roof and this roof are good and this one need to be changed in my opinion plus the one over there on the barn so this is what we need to be done but maybe doesn't need to be done straight away so let's go and have a look and see this is a beautiful beautiful conservatory entrance you can see the house has its own heating system so the radiator is here this is a really nice entrance hall so you can organize as you want for shoes, this side or this side, it depends how you want. And the roof we just seen, you can see the ceilings, really good, no problem at all, which I seen from outside because the way and the tiles, the way it has been built with a proper slope and the tiles up there, I can see that it's really good, you know? And you have a door here and you have access here. So. Let's go first of all and see what we have be behind this axis and then we are going to see what we have behind this door. But I'm just doing this to show you the conservatory properly. 
it's really nice you can even enjoy here you know of the sun and the daytime it's really good and look at the thickness of the building absolutely absolutely beautiful good stone work strong one it's a really strong house these area houses are amazing with this stone and look at the beam and this is all it's one beam oh my god it's one foot thickness amazing they're not next to each other this is one beam can you imagine look at the thickness of it oh my god yeah okay and the walls and this so what we do here we came here and we saw this premise which is like a, now it's like a storage a bit but it's a nice corner area and you can put your lovely cupboards here you can put some some wardrobes you can put some fridge freezer like this one because the kitchen is not far away so in one word it could be your like a utility room here i think and you can see the floors the floors are really good condition proper nice floors lacquer one yep and you go this way and you can see the walls with all this like this gap it's a beautiful building cupboard here you can put you know shelves so utility shelves perfect even it could be an office because you got light from there as well it could be an office like in the corner here with the internet so you can enjoy you know and look at the beams very important to show the beams strong oak beams the old one with a proper shape and the huge one here can you imagine look at this the huge one absolutely amazing Look at the walls, the stone. This house will last forever here. If you just look after the roof, all will be then. Look at this amazing thickness of it. I really like this. Really like this. Okay. And here you can see no any problems at all. And all is most important are original beams. And if you see the thickness, if you see the condition of them, sorry, you will see that this can last forever. And I'm not joking. And people who knows and who used to see the houses like this or live in the houses like this all over the world, they can say this for sure. They can confirm. Let's go and have a look what we have here. So here we go from the this, let's say, office space or utility room space. We go to the small corridor and we have a door here which door i'm going to open to you and show you that it goes out you can see this like an entrance it's a back entrance and it goes to the garden which we started our videos with it's over there you can come with the car stop the car here even just next to this door if you need to unload the stuff or whatever it's very handy you know and the most important is that the kitchen is on this side your utility or storage room is on this side so it's really good stop the car and you can use this it's very handy with this small roof which keep a bit area drier even when it's raining it's really nice so let's go back here and now turn left here and see what we have here we have of course we got kitchen look at the size of the kitchen a beautiful size a proper proper white kitchen so all the way with a countertop like here now this way this way this way this way and you can see you can put a lot of stuff on it a lot of stuff a nice shelves here are some sills a bit wider so you can use them to put the stuff on them like it is already being put there a nice gap with the window where you can put your stereo aircon which they use it of course for the winter or just for the, when it's cold and when it's cool when it's hot but i think this one because of the storm stone walls here it's really cool during the summer and very easy to heat during the wind you can see all this stuff washing machine dry washer you got all these cupboards really really good and proper enough you got the two fridge freezer fridge freezer here you got all this a lot of machines and you got this island really nice island really nice believe me i like this island and it's a lot of work top. so just need even i think it could be for a family with a husband with more than one wife because there is a space for three wives here say i'm wrong if you think but i think it's a space for three wives minimum and you got all this 
cups here, you know, like this corner for bread maker, this big extractor, a lovely view, sorry, a lovely view to the garden and to the mountain. And we still have all this space, amazing. Really, really good, look at this. Really good space, a lovely kitchen. And I'm going to show you now what else we have on this floor. So far we got this kitchen. It could be even used as a diner. That's why I think this one is extended from the main surface because you can put a chair and you can put your legs here. Very handy. And maybe it's the same like this. No, this is a cupboard. But you can put few people to have a, their meal here. Really good. Yeah, okay, once again, perfect. Look at the beams, um, original beams of this house. Look at this, beams next to the countertop. Look at this. Really nice, really nice. Some proper treatment, and that's it. A really good beams. Go back now, this is the back door. If you remember, this is the office or um, how do you call this? Uh, I call it utility room. And then we got the conservatory with the other entrance. And then we need to go this room. As far as I know, there is a cat, which I need to keep it here closed. Okay. Okay, let's see what we have here. Okay, here we have a living, living, living room. Look at the living room. Got the computer. And it got this beautiful desk as well. Wonderful. A wonderful, wonderful desk. I can say this. With all the carvery, masterpiece, beautiful one. You can say this one. Of course, you can see this one. You can see this one is a really nice desk. You know? So, it's not bad at all. Yeah. Then we got a window. We got another window, we got enough light. We got all this, I mentioned there with a heating system. This is a heating system. Actually, the heating system is here. This is the fireplace with a big boiler. This fireplace is connected to the radiator here. And you got another radiator there and you got a radiator in the kitchen as well, in the living room plus in the hallway, plus the conservatory there, if you remember. And I like the height of it. It's really high. And look at this. You got the dining table there area. You got aircon just as a spare. And also don't forget, you got this, which one is not connected, but it's heat this premise when it's not that much cold. Like tonight, the temperature goes down to 10 to 12. If you feel cold, you can let the fire here and that will sort out your problems for a while. Okay, look at the walls. All is a stone walls. Really, really good stone walls. And another aircon. So you got two aircons here. One there and one over there. Which is a really good idea. You can see there, yeah. Did you saw this? This is my right hand <laughs> finger. Look at the floor. I like all the floors are in a really good condition. They've been kept and very well looked after, you know. Of course, the property needs cleaning or whatever. But look at the beams and the ceiling. You've got a really, really proper, proper ceilings. Amazing, you know. Yeah. Strong beams. Everything is original here, by the way. Only this beam, I can say it's a new one because there were used to be a wall here, I'm sure, and used to be a wall here. That's why they put this instead of the wall. They put these beams as a supporting beam and this one as well. All the rest is original beams. And you can have a look, see them. Wonderful. I like all these original beams. I really like them. And I really enjoy them. I really enjoy these features of twisted stones, columns here. Look at this. And to be honest, it's so bright here. Doesn't matter, it looks a bit dark. But because you got shutters there and shutters here, otherwise it's bright enough. And you got windows and the back wall, you got windows on this side wall, and you got two windows in the front wall. Beautiful. So before we go and see the second floor, don't forget that there is a toilet here. It's a nice place to use 
under the stairs space. Look at this, really amazing, really amazing. So we have a toilet, we have a radiator here, we have this, but don't forget, I can see now, we got a shower room as well. Perfect, shower room, proper shower room, all good. If you want, retail, repaint or whatever, but you got it. You can come and start and live here straight away. Just put your proper, let's say, put your smell. I mean, you know, in a positive way, of course. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Look at this, a beautiful stone column. I'm going on my, I'm again on my knees. In almost every of my videos, I'm going down on my knees because I want to show the foundation or I want to show the floor. Doesn't matter, I do this on my knees. It looks like I'm in a confession room all the time and I feel guilty all the time. <laughs> oh my God, yeah. Look at this, beautiful, with a nice clock on it. Okay, now, if you remember, this is the living room. The conservatory is there. Then next to it, behind this wall and the toilet and bathroom, we got the office room or uh, utility room and then we got a small hallway with another access to the back garden where is the driveway and uh, which is fine and handy and we got the kitchen area as well if you remember that is good so now with these steps inside a proper steps proper wide steps wooden one lead us lead us to the second floor look at the steps they're not bad at all to be honest yeah, they are not bad at all. Now this is the second floor and you can see the good quality of the floor. I like this really very much. A proper white, <laughs> a proper, proper white, uh, not so big, but white enough corridor with, we got one room here, one room there and one room here. So let's go and have a look first of all what we have opposite. Of course, opposite, we got a toilet and bathroom with a nice, nice buff, corner buff. I like corner buffs. And you got this frosted glass, but in my opinion, because this is on the second floor, if it's me, I'll take off and I'll put a proper glass because I want, while I'm taking the bath and taking the shower and enjoy my glass of red wine, I want to have a look and see the beautiful view from there. Because if you remember, there is a wonderful view there. Otherwise, the bathroom is high enough, good, good good uh height and look at the ceilings they're really good not any visible problems at all which is good no any signs of a moisture you got this sink you got the toilet you know you got the good door you got a proper bathroom to do the service for all the rooms you have here then we're going to see and have a look what kind of the rooms we got here this is when the light is on so the first room is a big bedroom. Look at the size of this bedroom, really nice. And a high ceilings as well. They're painted white, air con. So every room has an air con and every room has a radiator, which is really good. The house is sorted out with the heating system totally, even with the summer cool options as well. Look at this, and a nice high ceiling with the original beams again, but in this case they are painted white, which is a good idea. Uh, this is a typical color for people from abroad, because in Bulgaria, you know, the communist colors are green or blue. So the white color wasn't so popular in Bulgaria, even not at all, only for the walls, you know, but I like the idea of painting the ceiling white because it's make a bit much more brighter and you got all this window here and window there and you know opinion about my opinion about this what i want to show you is how the thick of the walls thickness of the wall is that's why it's stone walls this side the house that side and the back side only the front side ground floor is stones and the bricks is only this front side okay beautiful and if i can have a look I'll see, I'll try to show you the view. Amazing, beautiful. And I can hear the birds even. While we're here, remind you about the wood construction window with double glaze. And they're in a good condition, just need to be painted. 
So we are leaving this, let's call, master bedroom. Once again, you can have a look at it. Have a look at it. This is where we came through. And, okay. Remind, remember these steps. We are going to see what is up there. Believe me. Maybe it would be a surprise. Bathroom, first bedroom. Second bedroom. Sorry, I forgot there is a hidden lock here. Okay, let's put the lights on. Another proper size of a bedroom. Smaller than the other one, but I can say it's nice one again. Look at the thickness here. Confirmation, beautiful view to the park, green park area. Wonderful. Look at the ceilings. Perfect condition. Which is remind me about the roof, which is confirming, sorry, not only remind me, but confirming that the roof is, is in a good condition. A really, really good one. Look at the beams goes around the chimney like a frame. Really nice one. Good work. Okay. Good size of a land of, of a room. So we've got now a second bedroom. We're going out. Then we're going to see. Then we're going to see what we have here. And this behind this room. So stairs, first bedroom, second bedroom, toilet and bathroom with a corner bathtub. Oh my god, this is the master bedroom. Sorry, I did make a mistake when I say that this is the master bedroom. Obviously, this is the master bedroom. Look at this beautiful size of a bedroom. Look at this. Unique. Good. Really good. Again, the height is amazing. Amazing height of the, of, the, of, the, of the rooms. Look at this. And another aircon. Good. And a radiator there. Perfect. And the ceilings. I think I put more attention on the ceilings, but... The, what I like is that everything has been kept original one, which is good. And you can see this, how old it is, you know, but amazing. Now, okay, so we saw this big room and we can see that there is another access there. Let's go and see what it, where this is lead us to. Okay, a small corridor with a nice window and another door and another door, thousands of doors. Look at this building. Look at this. It's not bad at all. Obviously, we are above the kitchen at the moment. I think not. We are above the, where the storage was and I was trying to go inside there, if you remember. Look at this. Nice, like a small living room. It could be like a living room with a, with a with a bedroom, and maybe we can say that let's go here. There's another room. It's always rooms and rooms, all the time rooms and rooms. What we got here? Here we got toilet and bathroom. Unfortunately, it's dark here. I don't know why. Maybe the bulb is gone. But it's a proper. Let me show you this way. We might much more light. It's a shower cabin here and i can't put the lights on the video and oh let me try to see if i can bring some more lights because i don't know is it is it why it's not working no it's not working here maybe because of the fuse box i can't find where the fuse box is anyway i'll do my best to do like this no, it's usual. Obviously, it's it's somewhere else, or maybe the power is cut off here. I don't know. Let's go and have a look. No, not power. Anyway, I hope you can see it properly. Nice floors. All these constructions, of course, has been kept, and this is the roof which I advise you to be changed. You know, because you can see, I was right. There's a few problems with the leaks already. You know, so I'm not so sure how fixed they are or not, but it's obvious that the roof needs need to be changed. You know, this is the plasterboard gone, almost. Not this side, not this side at all, as you can see, but this side here need fixing. So in my opinion, 
just change all the roof otherwise the construction is good keep the constructions you know treat all this and then everything will be will be nice with a beautiful view <laughs> with a beautiful desk you know in my opinion this is a really nice desk look at this desk yeah beautiful and let's try again to show the toilet and bathroom from here you can see the toilet and this is where the shower sorry i'm doing my best to show you maybe it's not toilet and shower cabin with a sink here just like this you can see the sink and the entrance and the shower cabin here with the shower on it sorry for this it's a bit not clear but this is what it is and then we got another door here so we got thousands of doors how oh, just quick remind about you this is the master bedroom we came through this small hallway then this door then we got this door let's have a look what we have here oh my god we got a we got a lover ah this is where it is the clue let's do it now bright welcome welcome to the let's the sunshine in now you can see beautiful wonderful i like this lover room this is a lover room this is when you all hide your lover yeah good one good just close this one and you got this room then we got this light then we got this place now we are going to see a proper 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 up even so bright look at this really good to be honest and it's a bit more wider than i expected a nice tiles you can see and the sink and the shower good not bad at all what i got here okay it's for a tall persons tall persons their head can go this way <laughs> okay really nice really really nice okay thank you very much for this thank you very much it's good it's always good to have a small rooms like this because you can hide everything not only the lovers you know and let me try to see what is here okay i think here is this is lead us to the big and nice veranda i know this definitely okay so what else we need to see ah don't forget we need to go back and to see the loft because in my video yesterday i promised to go and to take a video of the loft of the property i've been there yesterday and i forgot and somebody remind me but it was too late because i was three and a half hours away already but i got some photos when i put the property on my website then i'm going to show the photos or the person can leave me his email and i can contact and send him a photos of it unfortunately i really totally forgot about to loft to 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 show it let's go and have a look what we have here so it's proper so far going this way and that way let's see is there any light i think so beautiful look at this small space a wonderful small space it's a bit narrow lower sorry lower space here yeah a lower space but not bad so i think it's much much better for a storage or it could be small uh, like a grandson or grandchildren room really nice <laughs> and you can see the view from here again look at the view beautiful one yeah it's a nice place yeah could be just a relaxing room or something like this or even it could be a small office but the axis here is um, totally difficult you need to roll in your yourself you need to roll in yourself see <laughs> okay anyway it's nice okay now i think that's it so then we can go to the next stage <laughs>